Hi there, it's Jeff Greenberg. I'd like to show you how to get the most out of viewing files on your Macintosh and how to use List View, which is my favorite way to look at my files. So I want to start off here with taking a look at what's in this directory. This is my movies directory. And right across the top, I think you're probably familiar with it, are these one, this icon view, two, this list view, three, uh, they happen to call this panes, and four, the sort of media browsing view that when you click on files, you can see and actually look through them. And while I think all that's great, I use almost none of them. I do want to show you a much faster keyboard way. I all the time talk in commands. I'm commanding my Macintosh to do something. And in this case, it's one, two, three, four, command one, command two, command three, command four. You're going through the view menu here and you're going through icons list, columns and gallery. I'm going to set it back to list. Now, as long as we're under that view menu, I want to show you there are a couple other really neat ones here. I love to turn on the path bar. And that'll show you that I'm on my Macintosh in my users, in JG as a user in movies, and you can see which file I have there. I can double click any one of these and I can go right to that spot. You'll see I've gone up two levels. And I've got a back arrow here. This is just like a browser. I can just go back and it'll put me back in movies where I was. Now, just like I like the path bar, I also really like a view here called status. And the status bar tells me how many items are here and how much space is available in my system. All right, we're ready to rock and roll now. I'd like to move up and for the moment, I'm going to move all the way up to the top level of my hard drive or maybe just to my user. And for that, instead of me navigating here or having to create a new window and dig up and down, I'm going to use the command up and the command down key. The command up will go up one level. Command up arrow. And I'm now in my movies. And maybe I want to be, say, in my pictures. So I'm just using the up and down arrows to go up and down in the finder. And now I'm going to use the left and right arrows to open and close folders. If I want to just dig into the folder and move inside of it, I can use a command and a down arrow, and now I'm inside it, all without me having to use the mouse. And it's super crazy fast because I'm at the keyboard and I'm able to use both hands. These sort of views are crazy, crazy useful. And under the view menu is this other choice here called show view options. Now, normally I give you this really nice mnemonic like command one, two, three, four, or command left and right arrows, or the up and down arrows, just to move up and down in those listings. This is Command J. I think of this as the Jeff command. I don't know what you're going to call it, but I'm going to call it that. And this lets me define this specific folder. So I could say, maybe I always want my movies folder to be in list view. I can change how it's grouped or how large the icons are or how large the text size is. I can add any of these columns. My favorite choice is to always say calculate all sizes. And now suddenly, every time I have a folder, I know how large it is. And I'm going to just go ahead here and do a command up arrow. I'm in my user. That's my user JG. I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to say calculate all sizes. And it shows me how large all of the nested folders are. The last thing, and this is an optional choice, and there's no undo. So, Think about this before you do it. I'd like you to see here, there's a choice that says use at defaults. And if I press that button, every single window on my Macintosh, when I open it up, will be in list view and it'll be set. So it's going ahead and calculating all sizes. That one's up to you. And you might very much want to say, well, I want my whole Macintosh to be in list view, but I'd always like my pictures or my movies to be in command one to be in this icon view. But as I said, I pretty much like command to list view, and I have it set on my Macintosh systems to be used as defaults. So every folder I ever open up, every finder window will be in list view and we'll be calculating all sizes of all the folders. Again, I'm Jeff Greenberg. I like list view. I want you to like list view too. You don't have to make it your default, but remember that command up and at down arrow and the left, right, and up and down arrows to navigate 
in that list view really will help you go faster on your Macintosh. Thanks again for watching.